thought I'd get back into painting because I haven't done it for a long time. And I thought, you know what? I'll get out the old high elf army, which I bought very cheaply from an ex uh, games workshop employee because he basically was just getting rid of all of his figures. And uh, I think I've bitten off more than I can chew. I mean, Jesus Christ, how many have I got? I got these. I'm quite quite proud of that one actually. Uh, I got these for my daughter's medieval project. But so these are axe guys. That's a chariot. Bolt throwers. There's a group bits of a griffin. I don't know where the rest of that is. It's probably up still upstairs. And there's another chariot there, and a whole load of Bretonians. I painted some of the command models. I'm quite chuffed with that one. That one looks all right actually. The uh, skin colour is a bit weird in this in this light, but. And that mage as well. I know I painted all all black, but I just thought I'd go against the grain. And then oh, God knows what colours I'm going for with these. So yeah, I've got some new contrast paints. I might try. I'm very proud of this one. This one took me ages back in the day. Uh, now he's chipped. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there's there's a a lot. I mean, what the hell is that? Uh, that's some sort of Pegasus. Great. Can't paint feathers. Knights of the Grail, more horses. I've got so much cavalry. There's kind of like archer dudes, then there's dragon dudes, and then there's old school uh, elves on Bretonian horses, because that was a thing. And then, yeah, spearmen, axe, uh, halberdier men, archers. Not a lot of archers, to be honest. But yeah, 